Hello and welcome. My name is Vince. I am from Hamshack Reviews. Today we're going to do a quick tutorial on how to fill out your QRZ bio page. This is mostly for the new hams and the OMs that haven't done it before. So, QRZ is a platform for call sign lookup as well as other information like stories, propagation. Down here you can even list stuff for sale or buy stuff. Really great. Something from the ARRL. Yoda, use on the air. So, first thing we're going to do is scroll back up to the top. And I'm going to assume you already set a password. If you haven't, when you first get on to this site up here, it'll say login. And then next to it, it should say register. You're going to want to click on register. You're going to have to put in an email address. Your call sign will be your screen name. And then you're going to have to set a password. After you do that, you sign in. And then you're going to come over here all the way to the right in the blue column. You're going to click on edit your call sign. Okay, this top one here is for putting stuff in the top section. This is where your name and address is. It's where your awards from QRZ will be in, plus your uh, picture, your photo. This next one, second one down, is where you're going to fill out your bio. You can put pretty much anything you want about yourself or your radio gear. You can put pictures in here too, and you can move them around or resize them. Pretty easy stuff. Down here, the next one down, is where you put in your pictures. You first got to load your pictures into here. And then when you want to bring them up in here, they're already in QRZ. Next one down is where you put in the grid square and your coordinate settings. And this will give you a position on the map. Next one down is CSS styles. Unless you know how to code in CSS, that's not really of a concern. Yeah, W5YI charges you a fee. It's somewhere between 15 and I guess $25. This is for any kind of updates as well as applying for a vanity call sign. Next one down here, I haven't never used this one. This is if you want to add a Marine Mobile or... Uh, P34, like if you're in another area, another country, you fill that out. Next one is help. This one will guide you with some things you have to do with all these above. You may not find what you're looking in for there, but you just may well. Next one is frequently asked questions. I've never looked in there, but I'm sure there might be something there to help you if you need it. And then click done. After you finish all these, you have to click save on each one or you lose the work you've done. Okay, let's get up here and we're going to enter the top one. This is where you put in your name, your address, your EQSL and LOTW. And then you click save. Then we're going to go down to pictures. And this is where you're going to submit any pictures you want to submit. And then you click done. Then you're going to go back up here to your bio. Click on bio. Make sure to open up. And this is where you can write in about yourself. You can add a couple pictures. You can add your call signs. And I love this map. I'm going to get this big and put it on my wall. It's all the... Uh, Ham radio prefixes. Good stuff. And then when you're finished there, you click, where's it at? Save. Also, while you're in the bio page, you can click media in your little interface where you can make bold text or change the text. You hit media and it'll open up a window to where you put your pictures. And 
That's where how you get your picture onto your site. Then you can just grab a corner of it and move it in or out to resize it. And if you want to move it, you just grab on it in the center and move it to where you want it and release. Sometimes it'll move a little bit itself because it clicks to a grid. So you may have to maneuver things around, but it's not difficult. I had no trouble doing it. And then when you're finished, you come up here and hit your call sign and you can see your work you've done. You can see all this, you can see this, see your cards, and you can see this. When you are finishing, come back to the top of the page, come over here to the right side of the horizontal blue line and click on your page. Here you can see all the work you've done. You can scroll down and see your bio you put in. Please remember, like, subscribe, and share if you found my videos helpful or informative. 73s.